mind is everything. What you think you become. Do not dwell in the past. Do not dream of the future. Concentrate the mind on the present moment. We are shaped by our thoughts. We become what we think. When the mind is pure, joy follows like a shadow that never leaves. All that we are is the result of what we have thought. It is founded on our thoughts and made up of our thoughts. Your worst enemy cannot harm you as much as your own unguarded thoughts. There is nothing so disobedient as an undisciplined mind, and there is nothing so obedient as a disciplined mind. He who controls his mind is more powerful than he who conquers a thousand men in battle. If a man can control his mind, he can find the way to enlightenment, and all wisdom and virtue will naturally come to him. Peace comes from within. Do not seek it without. Happiness does not depend on what you have or who you are. It solely relies on what you think. You will not be punished for your anger. You will be punished by your anger. Holding on to anger is like grasping a hot coal with the intent of throwing it at someone else. You are the one who gets burned. In the sky, there is no distinction of east and west. People create distinctions out of their own minds and then believe them to be true. The way is not in the sky. The way is in the heart. No one saves us but ourselves. No one can and no one may. We ourselves must walk the path. You yourself, as much as anybody in the entire universe, deserve your love and affection. True love is born from understanding. Hatred does not cease by hatred, but only by love. This is the eternal rule. Radiate boundless love towards the entire world above, below and across unhindered, without ill will, without enmity. Just as a candle cannot burn without fire, men cannot live without a spiritual life. To keep the body in good health is a duty. Otherwise, we shall not be able to keep our mind strong and clear. Every human being is the author of his own health or disease, the secret of health for both mind and body is not to mourn for the past, nor to worry about the future, but to live the present moment wisely and earnestly. The foot feels the foot when it feels the ground. If you are quiet enough, you will hear the flow of the universe. You will feel its rhythm. Go with this flow. Happiness lies ahead. Meditation is key. Meditation brings wisdom. Know well what leads you forward and what holds you back, and choose the path that leads to wisdom. Your body is precious. It is our vehicle for awakening. Treat it with care. What we think, we become. Thousands of candles can be lighted from a single candle. Happiness never decreases by being shared. However many holy words you read, however many you speak, what good will they do you if you do not act on upon them?